Good morning. It's Lonnie with Crafty Traveler. Today is Tuesday, June the 27th, 2023. And Snickers and I will be leaving the Red Trail Campground in Medora, North Dakota. And we're headed south to South Dakota to Heartland RV Park, which I watched a video on this RV park and it looks fantastic. And we will be down in South Dakota for the next three days. So follow along. Hello, you have found my channel, The Crafty Traveler. My name is Lonnie and I am a 71 year old female who loves to camp and travel. I'm saying goodbye to my husband for the next four months as I travel across country with my little schnauzer Snickers. We're traveling in my Mini Winnie and towing my Honda. Come and subscribe to my channel and follow our adventures. Thanks for watching. Redtail Campground in Medora, North Dakota is very nice campground. Grassy areas, picnic tables. They don't allow fires because they're in the city limits. I had water and electric. And this is the dump station. Well, that's the dump station. It rained yesterday. Don't think I'm going to be dumping today. And there's the trash. No dumping today for me. I'll save it. Due to a thunderstorm yesterday evening, the dump station looks very flooded. So luckily I'm okay and I can make it down to South Dakota without dumping. I'll get there, have full hookups, and take care of those things when I get there. So follow along to South Dakota. Do you recall when we were young, running from all things at once, without thinking twice? I knew it would catch up and that we would be the ones left behind mm. The stories I've been told They never seem to lead my mind mm. And this road that I am on I gotta stay here for some time Somehow made it through without losing sight mm. And I still wonder where you are And if you found a way out from the dark mm. The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind mm. And this road that I am on Gotta stay here for some time. Well, we crossed into South Dakota a while back, and right over the border, I saw some antelope in the fields. Snickers and I are stopped for lunch in Buffalo, South Dakota. We're behind a gas station on a big lot. You can hear my generator going. I use that to power my refrigerator when I'm stopped rather than putting on the propane. I'm going to show you where we are. This is a beautiful little area. It just looks over the prairie. There's a little lake over there. Crickets are chirping. It's a beautiful area to stop behind this gas station just so uh, we have a place to have lunch and take a break. And uh, we better get going again back on the road. There's a gas station, restaurant. I see somebody else has pulled in for lunch, same idea. Just a big back parking lot. Perfect spot to stay for lunch. How come 
the stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are what makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of i wonder Sometimes hides behind the clouds Maybe it's just like me A little bit scared of heights Why does the rain always keep on pouring down When it's gray outside Snickers and I made it to South Dakota And to the Heartland RV Park and Cabins It's in Hermosa, South Dakota Which is a bit south from Rapid City. We're kind of out in the open here. It's pretty sunny today. It's about 80 degrees and it's predicted to be more thunderstorms tonight. Oh goody. <laughs> but tomorrow again is supposed to be clear or sunny during the day and then probably some rain at night. That's good. It'll cool things down. This park is huge. This park has a total of 182 RV sites. It has 20 tent sites and 16 cabin sites. Now, if that's too big for you, I'm sorry. This is a luxury park for me. I have full hookups, cable, and super good Wi-Fi. There's a pool and a hot tub. There's an event center, and they also have a restaurant in there. and they have entertainment during the night. They have live music a couple nights a week. I don't know if I'll get there for that, but we'll see. I certainly do want to go get pizza for dinner tonight. That will be fun. I could just get it and bring it back. And all this cost me $41.33 a night with my Good Sam discount. I don't think that's bad. Anytime I can get an RV park for less than $50, I feel I'm doing good. Don't get me wrong, I do enjoy boondocking with groups of people. But when I'm on my own, I feel safer in an RV park. And I do like the hookups. They gave me a three-page list of attractions uh, in the area, including Custer Park and Crazy Horse and Rushmore and Needles Highway. Here's the map that she gave me. And here's the area that I'm going to concentrate on. I have three days to see all of that. The other thing they gave uh, Snickers were treats. Yeah, he ate them already, but there were little doggy treats in here just for Snickers. So as I go around to the RV park these next three days and do video, I will put those videos on this video. This is one of the laundry houses. There's two of them in the park. They've got four washers and they're two dollars a load to wash. And the washing machines are 30 minutes and the dryers are 45. And they have four dryers. That's mine. But one of them is out of order right now. And they're $1.75. So I'm going to get mine started here. Actually, the dryers are $1.50 alone. Here's the showers. They have three showers, actually, four showers and a handicapped shower and this is the ladies room and this is the ladies room and there are three stalls and of course baby changing things and sinks it looks very clean i won't be using it but it looks clean wow i just ordered dinner from the restaurant here and they deliver it to my site I'm getting a pizza, 
jalapeno poppers, some wings, and an all mode brownie. Now, I'm not going to eat all that tonight. I'm going to put some of it away for tomorrow. But isn't that great? They're going to bring it to my site. No extra charge. But they do charge it all to my site. So I'll be paying for it when I leave, which is fine. I just got this delivery to my site from the event center here at the Heartland RV Park. There's pizza. I got poppers and wings and dessert. I better get that in the freezer. I'm not going to eat all of this tonight. Some of it I'll be saving for tomorrow. But it looks delicious. It's about 6 o'clock. We're here at the Heartland RV Park. And it looks like there's a storm coming. They did predict some thunder showers tonight. So I brought Snickers over to the dog park. We're in the smaller area, which is still bigger than a few that we've been in. And then there's a bigger area, but there's a bigger dog over there. Snickers has been watching him. So after he finishes running around in this side of the dog park, we're going to head back to the RV and batten down the hatches. There are RVs all over the place. Three rows back. All right. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, comment, share, and subscribe. Hey, you know, and the time of this video, which is June the 27th, I have 976 subscribers. I would really like to see that go up. To a thousand by the time this video gets posted wouldn't that be wonderful now the other little catch is not only do you need to subscribe to me but you need to watch my videos I need 4,000 hours of watch time in a year and I don't do that many lives I just haven't had good success with lives so if you subscribe please give my videos a watch and if you start out watching them and you think oh this isn't interesting or this is boring or I know this already just let it play out and always give me that thumbs up and you can even do that on your phone so look at the phone and you should see a little thumb and there's also a little paper piece white square in that same area that you can click on to type a comment. I would really appreciate it if you could all do that. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye now.